Hi, welcome to Matt's Garage. Today we're gonna to be talking about Bronco cooling. This 1966 Bronco came with the inline six radiator that is also in Mustangs of the same year. Um, not enough to do V6 cooling plus the uh, outlet inlet are in the wrong location. So I went ahead and upgraded because I didn't have the right part to the Tom's Bronco part aluminum radiator. This is a really nice unit. It's very light, nice welding all the way around. Uh, it comes with obviously the side tank for the uh, automatic transmission cooler. Uh, looks to be a good quality unit. Along with that, our radiator cap, and then an anode. This is a sacrificial anode. Uh, it screws in where the, uh, the pet cock normally goes, and that just uh, allows that to get eaten rather than other internal parts since you have dissimilar metals. Now, I also don't have a fan or a fan shroud, so let me, together, we're gonna figure out if this purchase I made is gonna work out. I bought this shroud from a company called Radiator Express, and they advertise it to fit the Bronco. Now, this has the inlet and outlet on the opposite side for a reverse rotation 302, which is what I have with the Explorer motor. Hopefully, I don't think that's gonna matter for the shroud. So you see it's pre-cut for a 16 inch fan. Um, that looks like it's either going to work or it's really close. I think that's going to work. The nice part about this is it keeps the fan really close to the radiator. Obviously, ideally, you want it set back a little bit, but um, you know these Broncos just have such little room for packaging. You need to get the radiator fan as far forward as possible. So, the whole, so all I'm struggling with here is is just about a millimeter of fit, which I'm pretty sure I can do if I just keep bending this flange in. You can see the holes line up. A little bit off, but I can pretty much hog that out and get it get it to work. And then, and then you just put a 16 inch fan on there, mount that up, and I'm done. For those of you interested in this upgrade, this is, the radiator is Tom's part number uh, 6372. That's a three core aluminum, reverse outlets for newer EFI motors. The shroud I got from radiatorexpress.com and the part number is 221576, electric, fraud, electric fan shrouds, aluminum single electric fan shroud. And then this, uh, motor, or sorry, this uh, radiator, this cooling fan, this electric fan is a 16 inch, I believe it's a Flexalite. It's an old one, it's the one that used to be on the Scout. But it doesn't really matter, you can put any 16 inch fan on here. Uh, this one's just nice and low profile. The only problem I have is with this Bronco, it didn't come, you know, because it, do it doesn't have the mount, the normal V8 radiator mount. So luckily, the previous owner had thrown the mounts into the Bronco, so I have the actual physical mounts, but I gotta figure out like where to put them and how high to mount them. I need to clean these up a little bit. These look like they were raw steel and just left to get wet. Paint them, weld them in, and then I can mount the radiator. And just taking a, taking a closer look at this, you may need to clearance it, so the way this sits out here, it doesn't look like this fits totally over the shroud, so I might need to clearance the shroud a little bit. Not a big deal, part of the process. I'll just notch it out and this will slide in. I just gotta get it figured out where I want it and then I can then I can mark the shroud where it needs to get notched. So that's it. Get out there and get your Bronco cool. See you next time on Matt's Garage.